Okay, today I'm going to review the HP Pavilion DV6809WM. I'm going to start by taking a look around on the left side of the notebook. First we have an S-Video out, VGA out, expansion port 3, gigabit ethernet, dial up. Now I would have an HDMI port here but this unit does not have that. Two USB 2.0, 1394 Firewire, and then there's the 5-in-1 media card reader or the SD, MS Pro, MMC or XD. On the front we have the Wi-Fi toggle, an infrared port, microphone, and two headphone out. Here we go over on the right side we have the express card slot or a place to store the included remote control. It's nice, it's got a power button on it and media functionality and you can control what's on the screen for the most part with this. And then the optical drive. This one is not the light scribe, however it is the DVD-RW multi-recorder. So it's what you'd need as a basic user. Another two is USB 2.0 port, making that a grand total of three USB 2.0, and the power. On the back, very clean, nothing there but a vent for the CPU. Again, on the front, we have two microphones, stereo microphone. It's wide, wide screen, 1280 by 800 HD bright view, and we have some blue backlit keyboard quick launch buttons. Now they tap when you hit them and they're actually not buttons they're touch sensitive. So they're pretty cool. When you hit the cap locks button a notification light comes on right next door to it to let you know that's on. And then there's a button on the keyboard to disable the trackpad. Which I at first that was dumb but now I realized if you're typing and you hit that it can go anywhere. So that's a nice button to have. Designated scrolling zone on this and it's really a rather large trackpad. The keyboard is fantastic. The keys are flat and it's very comfortable, very easy to type on. The Altec Lansing speakers are very good, and I believe there's four of them up here. And the, the finish on this is the Radiance. I don't know if you can see it on YouTube there, but it's, well, it sounds like what it is. It's Radiant, so you can kind of see it there. But it's called the HP Pavilion Entertainment PC. So it came with the AMD Trion X64 X2 processor, which means it's a dual core. And there are two cores of 2.00 gigahertz. It, ca it came with 3 gig of DDR2 RAM, which I've upgraded to 4. And it comes with a 120 gigabyte hard drive, which isn't a whole lot compared to some newer notebooks, but it's more than enough for me. So, in all, it's a very good machine, and I do highly recommend it. Thank you for watching.